Hello everyone! I hope you are all doing well and safe. Today we are going to continue our lesson which is collocations. Last session I gave you verb plus noun collocations. For example, keep a promise. Do you remember? Today I'm going to teach you another type of collocations, which is adverb plus adjective collocations. So today I chose some collocations that are really common in English language, that I personally like and of course native speakers use in their daily conversations. So let's see these collocations together. You have totally wrong. Wrong, it means khata. Totally, tamaman. Totally wrong. You can also use the opposite. The opposite of wrong is right. You can also say totally right. You are totally wrong. You are totally right. Anta ala khata tamaman. Anta ala sawab. Totally right. It is matching TR, just the American accent. <clears throat> Sorry. So when you have T in the middle, you can pronounce it R. Totally, totally. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay? So totally wrong. Totally right. Fully aware. Aware when? Fully bilkamil. Tamaman. I am fully aware of what I am saying. I am fully aware. And I wain. Tamaman. Perfectly clear. Perfectly clear. Clear. Wadih. Perfectly, uh, for example, the lesson is clear. Do you understand the lesson? My students can say, oh, it's perfectly clear. Okay? Okay? <coughs> I'm sorry. Bitterly disappointed. Disappointed, I am disappointed by your behavior. Okay, um, behavior was suluk. Bitterly, Okay, so disappointed, Bitterly, So bitterly disappointed, Okay, Strictly. Forbidden. Forbidden, memnoon. Strictly, bishat lintan. It is strictly forbidden to smoke in my class. It is strictly, bilkamil tamaman, okay? Forbidden, memnoon. If you pay attention now, what do you have here at the end of the word? L-Y. Fully. L-Y, perfectly, L-Y, bitterly, L-Y, strictly, L-Y. So what do you have with the word? When you have a word, kalima, plus L-Y at the end, last time I told you it is an adverb, all right? L-Y, it's an adverb. In English, L-Y, it's an adverb, remember. In French, it's like M E N T, rapidement, okay? M E N T, adverb. Bil uh, Arabiya, B sora, B, L Y. English, rapidly, rapid word, L Y, adverb, okay? We continue. Completely different. Different, it means مختلف. Completely tamaman, okay? 
It is completely different. مختلف بشكل تام. Okay. Absolutely incredible. Incredible. لا يعقل. Okay. Absolutely تماما. لا يعقل تماما. Okay. This is absolutely incredible. Highly impressed. Uh, impressed it means منبهر مندهش منبهر um, highly بشكل عالي أو بشكل تام so مندهش تماما highly impressed really amazing really amazing رائع amazing رائع really حقا okay رائع بزاف okay really amazing and Unbelievably expensive. Expensive by ten. Unbelievably, بشكل لا يعقل. It means it is really expensive. Really جدا. Okay, by ten. Now, what I want you to do, you follow with me. Try to work on the pronunciation as well, and then we move to our exercise. All right. So repeat after me. Totally wrong. Totally wrong. Fully aware. Fully aware. Perfectly clear. Perfectly clear. Bitterly disappointed. هذه طويلة شوية. Bitterly disappointed. Oh good. Strictly forbidden. Strictly forbidden. Good job. Completely different. Completely different. I'm sorry. Absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. Highly impressed. Highly impressed. Really amazing. Really amazing. Unbelievably expensive. Unbelievably expensive okay it's good to practice too now let's move to our exercise as usual all right now i hope you can remember the collocations we have just talked about and let's choose what are the correct collocations that we have to put here in this exercise all right so for example number one Casablanca is not the capital of Morocco. That is, that is wrong or right? Excellent, it's wrong. Rubat, which is the capital. But with the wrong, what do we use? We need collocations. Remember collocations? Two words that go together so we need here another one it is totally totally wrong it is totally wrong good job number two did you understand the lesson yes it is it is what it, clear or not clear for the collocation, we can say it is clear. Now, this is simple. It is clear. It is correct to say. We would like to use collocations to look like native speakers. You will answer the teacher by saying it is perfectly clear. It is perfectly Sorry. It is perfectly clear. Now it's much better. 
Number three. This movie is movie film, okay? So this movie is you like it so much, you love it. It is something incredible. So continue. I give you something, huh? It is. Of course, it should be uh, lowercase here. Absolutely incredible. It is absolutely incredible. It means you really, really like it. You love it. All right? Incredibly, absolutely incredible. Number four. I am of my own my own problems my own decisions has be of my own decision Kara. i am responsible legally responsible it is correct no problem we would like to have collocations here ana wa in tamaman bi qararati al khassa but in english I am fully, okay, continue, fully what? When, if you remember, aware, I am fully aware of my own decisions. Number five, the twins, so am. the twins have personalities, okay? Brothers, sisters, people, okay? We don't have similar personalities so we have different personalities but we need two words here tamaman <clears throat> com pli pli completely different personalities all right so these were just certain uh, collocations that native speakers use and I would like you to use them as well to improve your uh, your English. Now, if it's possible, can you give me uh, a sentence using any collocation that we have seen together in the comment section below, okay? You can give me also new collocations if you know some. All right. Thank you so much. And I will see you in the next video with a new lesson. Bye-bye. إذا أردتم مشاهدة جميع الدروس التي قمت بها سابقا يمكنكم الذهاب إلى القناة اضغط على كلمة playlist أو قائمة الفيديوهات وسوف تجد المستوى الأول ابتداء من حروف اللغة الإنجليزية والمستوى الثاني والثالث والرابع وكذلك الخامس